Lights are shining down on the players here at the home of Manchester City. I'm Derek Ray, in position to bring you live match commentary, and my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one, my goodness, so much to look forward to. It is Manchester City facing FC Copenhagen. Well, Derek, although the hosts are clear favourites, this could prove to be a tricky game for them unless they score an early goal because their opponents will sit deep, remain compact and defend with determination. They also pose a threat on the counter-attack and are really good at set plays. It's going to be an interesting one. Introducing the starting players from Manchester City. Ederson begins in goal. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And the lone striker today is Erling Haaland. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, we've got the same shape here, so today could be about which wingers are the most effective. So this should be a really good watch today. Contest begins. Making considerable progress with the ball. Goalkeeping of the highest order. Well, he's got to be pleased with that save. It's absolutely magnificent. Keen to take it short here. It's a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. It's a nice looking ball. Simply couldn't beat the first defender. That is how to apply the pressure. It's always a great thrill to watch Erling Haaland in action. He can be absolutely unstoppable, and we should expect that he'll have a prominent role to play in this one, Stuart. Well, he's a fantastic striker with the ball. Generates so much pace, and when he strikes it cleanly, the ball starts to dip and swirl on its way to the goalkeeper, which is why he needs to be closed down quickly today. Silva.
Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. And the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Le Raga. It's got to be! Can they cover up? And eventually, goalkeeper's ball. Well, you can sense the relief amongst his teammates. What a first save that was. The through ball. And the angle wasn't all that favourable, but he didn't let that bother him, did he? Well, really close, but were there better options? in the middle he continues his run that's how to do it inside your own penalty area the high press at the right side of the post, could he? But he met it so well. Silva. What to like about that pass. Well, Joe King, just as it was looking promising. Well, part of the story here, I think Holland struggling to make an impact, and how often do we say that? Yeah, he's been well marshaled so far, but he hasn't worked the defenders or the goalkeeper hard enough. He's got to impose himself on this game, otherwise they're going to struggle to get back into this. Leading it through, he's managed to get in behind. And so the half-time whistle is sounded here in Manchester. Well, he's been the standout for his side.
Brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power, the keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. So, that comes away. Intriguing contest, this, given the 2 1 scoreline. are making so much noise here they believe the winner's coming but it needs a moment of inspiration for one of those players out on the pitch what a finale we've got and quick thinking defensively and the Anusi Denis Favreau of the 19 still to go and the teams cannot be separated Rasmus Fag can they notch in front late on here well nothing comes of it it looked promising Chances on, and the referee has given it. It will be a penalty. Can they forge ahead? Well, he's avoided a booking, but the complaints continue. I can understand why. I think it's a poor foul. It should be a yellow card for me. Now to restore their lead here. Well, here we can see it again. Keeper's gone the wrong way, and it makes a fairly easy finish in the end. That's how to take a spot kick. 3-2 it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? Well, there goes their final whistle, and Manchester City will be wondering where on earth it went wrong for them tonight. A terrible start to their Champions League campaign. 